So you can really do it? Take the Dark One dagger and put it together with Arthur's sword to recreate the original Excalibur? I hope so. And we can use it to save Emma. Perhaps. But I need two things. The magical means to unite the two blades. That's my and Emma's quest. From you, I need... The two blades. We're pretty much at the open warfare stage now. Getting the partial sword from Arthur won't be easy. As long as you're looking at the future, any hints on how? Well, the future isn't exact. There are many parts. Of course there are. You're willing to send us behind enemy lines, but when it comes to specifics, everything's a little fuzzy, isn't it? Hook, Merlin's helping Emma. Is he? She's sitting out there right now making things to pull memories out of people's heads because that's what she does now instead of sleeping. I'm not quite seeing the helping. I understand. I know what it is to lose someone you love to the Dark One. All I can ask of all of you is that you bring me that sword. And that you have patience with Emma. Her kind of power, for good or evil, it is a weight on the soul. And love is a great help, if you can find it. You return by nightfall, right? Yes, we go get this spark thing, and then I'm working my way back to you, babe. I know, and you're quoting something. And I love it, you never know what it is. Anyway, with a bit of luck, we put Excalibur together tomorrow, and then Pam, no more darkness. Be careful, Emma. Oh, whoa, whoa, Calm down, whoa. Swan. I'm not proposing. You know I'm a survivor. This ring is why. I've had it for many years. It's the reason I'm alive. Or it could be. Who knows? You know, I can't die today. I'm immortal now. The Dark One is immortal. Emma isn't. Bring her home to me. At the very least, it's a reminder that you've got a piercing eye and smoldering pirate here who loves you. Thank you. I love you too.